Hello everyone, we will continue the topic BAPI and in the previous video, we started with the creation of the business object and we provided the various things. We provided the object type, we provided the object name, super type, name, description, application, program name, these all things we provided. If you want to check, you can simply, simply click on to this basic data button and you can see the various things, whatever you provided. Now we will proceed from here. Now just see, we have interfaces, we have attributes, we have methods, we have events. These all are the concepts are always, always available in object oriented programming. So what is this? This is totally, totally a object oriented concept. What is class? A class is a collection of objects. What are those objects? Those are methods, interfaces, events, attributes. So this is just a class. And class has these objects or components. So it's, it's totally, totally object-oriented programming. We will go for further more closer. If I'm expanding the method, just see, this is your object name. This is your object name. This is the method name. This is the method name. SAP provided these methods. Just compare it to your object-oriented programming. You are writing the logic in the method and how you are calling the method through the object. Same thing is there. We have the method. We have the method and how we are referring to the method, how we are calling the method through object, object dot method, object dot method. Now we will proceed further. So this is totally based upon object oriented concept. Now we will proceed from here. We have the object name or I will say business object name. This is the external identification of business object. This is internal identification of business object. And I told you the most important is external identification of business object. So this is our business object. We already created the function module. Now we want a BAPI. If we want a BAPI, it means this business object should bind with this function module. Now the question comes, how, how we will bind our business object means this business object with our function module, which we created. And the answer is method. If someone asks you how you created the business object, you have the function module, how you binded them so that it will make a BAPI. The answer is method. With the help of method, we will bind the business object with the function module. Now we will see how we will do. I will click on to utilities. I will click on to API methods, application programming interface method. I will click on to add method. I will pass the name of the function module. This is the function module which we created. I will go for OK. Now you can see it is asking for method method. Now I will give the method name as create because we will follow the best practices which SAP suggested. Now why I gave create? We'll go for again backtracking. I will go to SC37 transaction code. See, this is the function module which we created. This is the function module. Namespace, BAPI keyword, underscore, business object name, and this is your method name. This is your method name. This is the naming convention we followed. So what is our method name? Create is our method name. So I will pass the same to same thing because we should follow the best practices which SAP suggested. 
I will go for next step. Now you can see the function module parameters automatically appearing here. P employee import return export. Is this the same to same thing while creating the function module? We have one import, we have one export. Same thing is appearing. Now we will go for next step. You will go for yes. Now you can easily, easily understand object name dot method name. If I will double click, if I will click on to a app tab, this is the function module. And in the function module, we have the logic. Just simply it's a object oriented totally. You have the logic in the method. How you are calling the method through object? Yes, we have the object. We are calling this method. Method is what? Method, we have a function module. And in the function module, we have the code. So we binded the object with our function module. How? How? With the help of method. Most important concepts are going on. Now we will proceed further. In the previous video, we gave the program name. And I told you in this program, we have the source code of the business object. Suppose I will click on to program. You can see you are getting some predefined logic which is given by SAP. Is this the same to same function model which we created? Yes. We have importing P employee. So here it is coming as exporting. We have the exporting return there. Here it is coming as import because we all know whenever we will call the reusable things, import will become export, export will become import. Depends upon the requirement. Sometimes we will add our own logic here also. But this is the predefined logic given by SAP and whatever the function module we created, the logic is that it is automatically coming here. So what we studied in this particular video and what is the understanding of the topic? In this topic, we studied major most important thing. Whatever is visible to us, this is all, all object oriented concept. Just related to more closer. In the previous video, we have a super type also. What is super type? It is just like a super class. Whatever is in the existing super type, you can use in the new type. This is inheritance. Again, object oriented property of oops. So this is all your object oriented concept. Now we have the object. We have the function module. How we binded these two things? with the help of method. So how we created the method? We went to utilities, API method. We click on to add method. We pass the function module and we gave the method name. So with the help of method, we binded the business object with the function module. And lastly, I show you the program and in the program, in the program, SAP is providing the logic in which our function module is automatically coming. Depends upon the requirement, we can add our own code here also. Rest part of the BAPI, we will continue in the next video. Thank you.